Hello and welcome to Infinite Learnopedia channel. This video is about question execute the following commands. Under this first question is type command to display today's state. So let's get started with command prompt and execute all these commands. Firstly type in the search cmd or type command prompt. This is the window of command prompt which shows operating system here operating system is Microsoft Windows and version of the OS so this is the prompt so this indicates the location where we are now so this is C drive users folder into users is the admin folder so firstly let's change the path so here I will change my disk to D to change disk type disk name and colon and press enter execute the first question that is type command to display today's date so the command to display today's date is date command D A T E and press enter here you can enter new date else you can skip this to skip press just enter second question B question is create a new directory and give it your name now let's create a new directory and give a name to create a directory command is mkdir which stands for make directory followed by file name or directory name type file name give any name to the file and press enter here strawberry name directory is created C question is create files in your directory as test1.txt and test2.txt here we have to create two types of file with .txt extension so extension explains the type of file .txt stands for text type of file .doc stands for document type of file .xls x stands for excel file and so on so firstly let's create test1 and test2 for this use cd command to use strawberry directory here cd stands for change directory and strawberry is the name of the directory or folder press enter and now we are on the location into d drive and we are on the strawberry directory now let's create test1 and test2 for test1 to create a file command is copy con and type name of the file test1.txt press enter so in the next line you can type text which you want to edit for example this is my test file use ctrl z to exit from this file and the file is created successfully now let's create second file that is test2 copy con test2.txt and press enter into this i will add text this is test2 file Press enter and use ctrl z to exit. Second file test2 is created successfully. Now I will check my files using dir command. So I have successfully created test1 and test2 files. 
Next question says create two more files demo1 and demo2 with .doc extension. Type copy con demo1.doc press enter. Here you can add text Use Ctrl Z to exit and demo 1 is created successfully. Similar way we'll create demo 2. Press enter. Use Ctrl Z and press enter to exit. So with the help of CopyCon, we have created two document type of file and also edited into the files. Use DIR to view all the files in the directory strawberry. There is one more command that is DIR slash B small b and press enter. This command, this command is used to list all the files and folders inside directory so there is slight difference between dir and dir slash b here we can only view files list of files whereas here we can view time date of the files also next question is display list of dot txt files under directory created by you fifth question says only display files with .txt extension. So let's write the command for this dir space star .txt. So this means star means all the files with extension .txt from the directory strawberry which is on the location D. And press enter. So here are the files with dot txt extension test1 and test2 so in this video we learned about how to display a date how to create new directory so mkdir space file name and here we used mkdir and the file name was strawberry and you have to press enter after this right so the third question where we created two files with the help of copycon command and before creating file we have to use directory strawberry right and then create copycon test one dot txt and enter some text this is test1 file. Control plus Z to exit. Next, we created test1 using copycon. Sorry, test 2 using copycon. Again, this is test 2 file. You can enter any text inside. Use control Z to go back to the prompt. Next, over here. Copycon demo one dot doc. This is Word document one. Again, Control Z. Use Control Z for prompt and to exit from this line. Secondly, Copycon demo two dot doc. 
and this is word document 2 again control plus z to exit and the last question answer is dir star dot txt so this is the first question that's all for this video i hope this video will help you to execute commands successfully do not forget to hit the subscribe button like this video and share with your friends thank you for watching have a wonderful day